hello everyone this is asmr if you welcoming you to my new photoshop tutorial and today again i'll show you the logo of the photography that means the signature type photography logo so this type of logo uh, you know that this one is like the professional logo making tutorials so uh, you might know how to make this type of just uh, signature type uh, logo for the photographers so if you are new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications so let's start at first i'll go to the file and take a new canvas or artboard whatever you can tell and the size will be 2560 and 1440 and resolution will be 200 pixel per inch and obviously those are pixels the width and height and hit the create button and after that select the text tool and select once and then uh, just uh, make it default i'll use the font that is the hasnita and then just i'll write down the name of h kamali and just paste it and make it black so that's fine i just written this one but here is a problem the gap between two letters is uh, too many and the all are capitals so how to fix it up here is the character options if you don't get this here go to the window and the characters you'll get over here and from here and uh, double t that means the double all are capital just unlock this one uncheck this one actually and here is the options the space between two letters and make it zero and hit the enter button it will be normal so make it like in the middle of the artboard yeah that's fine and then i'll choose the photography this one and take another layer which is a text layer and now i'll make the font exo 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 regular and make the font size like 30 and i think the 20 is good and press ctrl v yeah photography and in this case i'll make all the capital of the photography like this one photography and how to do that select the photography this type layer and the character and now give the space between two letters 600 and then the all the capitals so placement will be in the middle of the layer yeah that's good and you can save it out for your photography purpose or if you want to make it white color you can do that so the background is white that's why you won't get the white color here so for that i'll just embed a photographs behind the photo and hit the tick button and then adjustment layer the solid color i'll choose the solid color which is a dark type and hit ok and then obviously i'll make it a little bit down yeah that's fine now i'll change the color suppose the photography this color i'll make from the character panel i'll make it white and then h camely and this one as well white color so you are getting like same to same logo signature type logo over here so the major thing is that how to get the font so if you want to get the font please check out my video description and i'll give a download link of my facebook page and you'll get the download link over there so the two font here the normal font that is the sand sheriff type font and another one is the uh, calligraphy font now the special thing of the font is like that k is like that like round or extra things so how to do that just select the family this one select the y you will get the options over here so this one is the options those are the like uh, glyph glyphic that means the extra things which is like uh, the design or other stuffs the glyphic the name of the extra thing is the glyphic and the k as well yeah hit the tick button now you're getting the same to same photographs or signature type logo if you just uh, made the logo like that it won't be like professional but if you make like that it will be professional just because of these type of glyphics 
so select these two things make it in a middle alignment and select these two and make it the name logo and then select all the things make it in a middle of the artboard if you need you can make it bigger yeah that's good and how to export this one and how to now uh, how could you use that so turn off all the things you'll get the just logo only and when you are getting the box or box type the background that means you are getting the transparent background press the file options and here is the option save as and from here just choose the png format and i'll give the name like <laughs> like this and save it out and hit ok suppose you want to just replace this signature type logo on your photography so how to do that go to the file and open up suppose you got the picture suppose this picture or this picture you got that but you want to put the logo here so how to do that file place embedded options you got this logo make it make it bigger and suppose you want to place it here so select just place here yeah or you can place anywhere if you need you can change the opacity mode yeah you'll get the uh, professional look of your photography so this one is the techniques of how to make the signature type logo and how to replace or how to export this one how to place on your photography and uh, i think this one will help you a lot those who are involved in the photography and uh, photography professions actually or hobby type photographers uh, i think it will help you a lot if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and thank you so much thanks for watching my video tutorial if you have any kind of question query or request please do comment on my video comment section and if you need the font download link please check out my video description and photo credit as well and i'll leave the next video i may say signing out today and bye bye